Being selected as the class 1 group A gadgeted officer in the Indian Railway Services was used to be the dream of many of the engineers of the nation and yes for this very with utmost passion complete hard work students used to prepare for the engineering services examination dedicatedly along with the gate preparation back in december 2019 there came a notification that all the recruitment to railways whether technical or non technical will be handled by a separate body now named as irms indian railway management services and you know immediately just few months after that you know the entire nation or the entire world i would say was struck by covid and the things about the recruitment got uncertain yeah but it was so clear that now okay as of now uh, as of those situation that the technical officer recruitment to railway was not happening through engineering services examination and almost all of the engineers of the nisha were disappointed okay then there comes a notification okay somewhere around one and a half to two years back that now the uh, recruitment okay every sort of post whether technical or non technical will be filled by upsc civil services examination which was totally heartbreaking especially for the aspirants who were preparing for gate as well as engineering services but of course you might have you know followed the previous updates and previous news due to some logical and technical reasons it was so agreed that you know at least uh, the technical recruitment officer positions okay through civil services examination was put on hold okay uh, now you know what's going to happen next was not certain but now there comes a very sweet very big i would say biggest surprise of the year for all the engineers dated just 5th of october dated two days back today is 7th of october and yes an official update coming up from the government of india that is ministry of uh, you know by the ministry of railways dated 5th of october and it's really something i would again say the biggest uh, surprise the gift okay you can call it as you know uh, dipavali dashera you know all festive season bonus for all the engineers and yes and yes have a look into it okay so you can see the participation of ministry of railways in the engineering services examination 2025 itself okay in respect to the irms okay so you know Uh, as if that complete uh, you know uh, this article mentions that yes uh, the recruit they have been recruiting officers okay through civil services 2022 onwards but now it has been decided that the ministry of railway by ministry of railway that the recruitment to irms will be made through both civil services and engineering services that means you come exactly to the situation what used to happen okay till around 2019 or so yes okay the recruitment okay to railway okay to the indian railway would be made through civil services as well as engineering services the technical officers being recruited through engineering services and all the non tech and administration level post okay through civil services examination okay of course the lower level you know group d post and all they have separate examination okay but majorly if i talk about the you know the group a technical post okay now will be through engineering services examination and the, this notification comes on 5th of october and if you have a look into it okay very carefully very thoughtfully they have you know tried to made a decision maybe a lot of discussions were going on okay and this is the upsc official notification uh, which is dated 18th of september this is the upsc engineering services 2025 official notification wherein okay uh, 232 vacancies earlier were announced 232 vacancies were earlier announced okay if i have a look into this notification important point i would like to say here is okay looking into this notification okay yes that 8th of october i'll show you exactly where that point is yeah this is where this is what i want to highlight here dear right now see the application form started from 18th of september and it goes on till 8th of october till 6 pm that is till tomorrow okay so you know if you have filled the engineering services form fine but if your dream was okay to up to you know work as a technical group one group a officer in the indian railway specifically and then only wanted to appear for engineering services so yes okay yes the time is still there for you till tomorrow you can still fill up the application form okay so thoughtfully i think they have decided you know to give this notification before 8th of october okay so i'll tell you uh, once again that the recruitment is now as it used to be earlier okay technical post through esc okay and all administration post okay through civil services examination this has been approved now how many vacancies now this brings on this brings on an additional 232 vacancies were announced earlier okay now this brings up a, you know a good number of vacancies almost equivalent to what were announced without the railway also and not only guys not only this time even earlier the major bulk recruitment used to happen in railways 
Okay, that is why engineering services, okay, many aspirants were fighting dedicatedly for engineering services. But of course, when the railways was removed, there are other certain departments are there, but still when the railways was removed, okay, uh, the charm of engineering services, the craze, the passion of students towards working hard for engineering services, I would say honestly, was reduced. Okay, but now coming to the breakage of vacancies there, here it is 225 total vacancies have been announced. Branch wise also bifurcated. These mostly they are tentative in numbers. Sometimes uh, they may increase or decrease. Decrease very rarely. Sometimes mostly they increase. Like last two years back also we have saw after the notification. Okay, one or two months down the line they increase the vacancy also. That also sometimes happen. Now out of this 225, 75 is for civil, 40 is for mechanical. Okay, always in rail railway civil always used to have uh, the largest number of vacancy. 50 for electrical and 40 for okay. Uh, the electronics, so this SNT signal and telecommunication primarily you would say, okay, this is basically for uh, electronics uh, candidates, okay. So, you know, now IRMS stores, okay, there are 20 vacancies in store also, that will be for all the above four disciplines whose bifurcation will be uh, informed to you later, that is what they have clearly mentioned, okay. Now, what this notification clearly means is 232 vacancies were announced earlier. 225 are announced now and this leads to 457 okay so nearly 457 vacancies are announced through engineering services 2025 and if you look into the trends of you know earlier year before 2020 like 2019 2018 17 roughly i would say the vacancies used to be in the range of 500 to 600 the vacancies used to be in the range of 500 to 600 okay 500 to 600 used to be the number of vacancies okay 500 to 600 so we have we are almost coming back to the same trend okay those those time as well sometimes the vacancy would be 450 also but mostly 500 600 sometimes it may be 7 800 also okay but from 2015 to 2019 the trend you say more or less 500 to 600 vacancy and let me also tell you that this is not only for this time see Last four to five years, there has not been any recruitment in the railway for the group A post, okay, especially for this technical post, there, not, there has not been any recruitment, okay, but all these along four to five years, okay, the people who were at the higher must post, they were every year, some, you know, some people were retiring and there was a need, okay, there was the need, you know, because the decision was not finalized, so there was no recruitment happening, but it doesn't mean that there was no need, there was the need of engineers in the railway, but it was getting delayed and delayed, but every year, okay, and this four, five years, every year, okay, you know, the people were getting retired, that phenomena did not stop, what stopped is recruitment, okay, so there is definitely a gap, there is definitely a big hole, okay, but they do not fill the big hole in one shot, of course, Okay, so you know year by year, this I'll expect this 225 or 250, 300, I'll say 200 to 300 vacancy almost every time you'll be expecting in the railway. Okay, so even if uh, you know, maybe you are second year, third year aspirant who will be writing engineering services in the final year, be ready now, it is finalized, it's not going to change. 99.99% I would say there's not going to be changed. So even for engineering services 2026 or 27, the railway recruitment through the railway technical officer recruitment will be through engineering services examination. Okay. So, you know, you can be prepared for it and almost good number of vacancy will be there for railway because of, okay, the big hole, the big void I would say created in the past four to five years. Okay, the past four to five years. Also, you know, uh, if, if I if if this if I just show you this two thirty two breakage. Also, I've written it somewhere. Yeah, I'll mention that also. Or uh, rather than this, I'll mention you know out of this four fifty seven. Now, how much is total for civil? The total for civil becomes one sixty five. Okay, including the earlier uh, notification in other department plus the railway. Okay, and uh, then in mechanical it is sixty because in me mechanical there were very few vacancies twenty in the earlier notification that came up. For electronics, it becomes uh, 92. For electronics, it becomes, sorry, this one. The electronics, it becomes 92. Okay. And uh, and here it is, one. sorry, this is 120, correct. Electrical 92 and total 120 for electronics. Okay, total 120 for electronics. Okay, core plus these 20 vacancies. Okay, whose, uh, you know, uh, bifurcation is not informed as of now. Okay, so it's very good opportunity for almost all the branches, relatively low in mechanical, but for other branches, it's 100 or more civil, uh, you know, 160 odd vacancies are there. 
earlier there used to be still 200 250 vacancy but yeah more number of vacancies will keep coming railway has now started recruiting and it's going to go on for the recruitment of technical group a officers through engineering services only for the upcoming years as well so that's the very big update of the year okay i would i would say festival you know festival surprise for all the engineers it was not expected okay that you know suddenly you know before the last day of the form filling up okay see it was definitely there uh, you know when i spoke to some of my friends or my juniors working in the railway it was definitely you know uh, after the previous notification okay where they told that every recruitment through civil services okay but that was put on hold due to some obvious technical reasons okay so uh, it was very much expected that the recruitment of technical officers will be through engineering services only but will you know because there was no update from lot of times so it was not that expected that they are going to do it through 2025 only so add on bonus for you okay so those who filled up the form already now i think you might be more excited more ignited within you because the dream job for every engineer is that is in the indian railway services has come back through upsc engineering services examination yes for the technical post okay that being to be tech selected as technical officer you don't have to appear in civil services this is through engineering services as the earlier trend okay and those who have not filled but they had the dream of uh, you know appearing in rail you know working in railway okay and since railway was removed from engineering services that was the reason you were not filling up the form you can take your day out tomorrow okay and fill up the form it's there till tomorrow 8th october 6 pm okay do not miss it out and work hard okay 9th of february as you know is the exam date for engineering services examination okay uh, that is the second sunday earlier it or you last two three years trend if you see it was happening on the third of the uh, you know sunday of february but this time it is second sunday and gate on the first and third weekends okay although the uh, where which branch on first and third weekend that is not exactly notified as of now uh, but yeah keep preparing hard okay uh, the paper one and paper two both right now your target is engineering services prelims as well as gate mains will be of course your second step once you qualify the prelims okay so uh, you know uh, big congratulations to all the aspirants even if you are just entered into engineering or maybe second year third year first year whatever your status is okay when you pass out and when you had a you know a final dream of uh, being selected in the indian railway services okay then also you must be really happy because now your vision is clear now your roadmap is clear that to be sitting you know in the indian railway uh, services you have to qualify and crack the engineering services the three stage examination prelims mains and the interview okay this is it uh, from my side very important okay biggest update of the year is in front of you the diwali the shara all festive season bonus okay coming together for you in the form of okay the additional 225 vacancies okay by irms to be through engineering services examination okay as i clearly mentioned to you that okay as i clearly mentioned to you that irms will be recruiting both through cse and ese but technical post through ESC and these 25 vacancies that I have mentioned is through ESC. Okay, there will be separate, uh, you know, the administrative and non-technical posts through civil services, but these are the vacancies recruited to the IMA, IRMS through engineering services only. With respect to that only, we have spoke. Okay, so all the very best. Keep preparing hard for your engineering services 2025 examination. Bye-bye. Thank you. Stay safe and do take care of yourself.